just finished my solo debut album and I am very excited and very enthusiastic to share it with you. The album will be released by Grand Piano Records on March 12th. I had played a selection from the two children's albums years ago during my early studies in Malta. At the time, I found them quite demanding, but the music stuck in my head for years. A few years later, I brought them back into my repertoire and I actually performed some of the shorter works during my first recitals and I started to love them more and more. I find some works from these albums quite funny actually and they remind me of uh, kids' movies. In preparation for this album, I had a couple of years worth of studies of researching and at the same time passing through a number of emotions, personal ups and downs and many other experiences. I guess I am the most proud of the recording of the recitatives and fugues. I remember the first time that Ate Shorga, my producer, introduced me to these works I remember saying to myself, wow, these works are truly inspiring. They are a little darker and very different from the children's albums which I had known for years. But I felt that I connected with them and I just wanted to study them. Well, they are very particular. They are quite a challenge for pianists. Every time I returned to these works, I understood how badly I wanted to record them. Now, finally, I have my own version of these works and I feel that I did it while having a lot of fun. Recording these works and working closely with my producer Ate Shorka and engineer Dave Rowell has been pure joy. They were totally dedicated to this project and we had a mutual understanding from the very beginning. I am extremely grateful to the BOV Joseph Kalea Foundation for fully supporting this project. The recording would not have been possible had it not been for the generous support of its patrons and founders. So from here, a heartfelt thanks to the Joseph Kalea Foundation. I really hope that people will feel a multitude of different emotions when listening to this album. Solitude, joy, grief, pain. I hope the listeners will feel the atmosphere.